Hello everyone, we are Foster Leader. Today, I will introduce this rain rotary for you. Once you receive this rain rotary, this spare part will follow with this rain rotary. I'll show you this spare part and I'll show you how to install it on the rotary. This is spring, this spare spring. Here already set up one. Rotary is a four types of folder, also you can call it the jaws. It's a two kind of small, small holder and the two kind is a, uh, a little bigger uh, holder. It's a bigger one for this uh, kind screw on outside. And uh, this uh, small one is for holder the small object. It. This, this uh, ring rotary can hold uh, the minimum uh, ring di diameter is uh, one centimeter. The maximum is uh, 80 millimeter. So you can put it here, one, fold here. So you can adjust diameter and uh, how input first three big jaws. Now we can do marking on brick, brick slide. And uh, this uh, small jaws, you can screw on here. The one, two, this three holder can hold this uh, ring. For marking ring here. So now remove this ring. Also, you can adjust this screen. This uh, can do the clockwise or unclockwise. For inner holder or outer holder. Now is a hot for outer holder. Yeah, now it's ready to marking the ring. Now we can mark in inside the ring. So just loose, select this uh, spot here and uh, adjust angle of this. Uh, Ring rotary. Like this, we can mark it inside the ring. This is a plug of this ring rotary. So, before marking, you have to connect this plug with this main box. Here is showing rotate. Go on, heading up. Okay. This is a brass ring. We put this ring on a rotary, and the confirm its position is correctly. Uh, for marking inside the ring, we have to adjust angle of this ring rotary. Uh, lose this spot here. Also, here, two part, we adjust this angle of this ring. This angle. Mm. So, with that, we can mark it inside the ring. And next, we have to make this box list is right on this brass ring. On this uh, EDCAD software, we input a text. The ring, it seems the uh, power and the speed to 300 millimeter per second, and the power is 20 percent. After that, we click this laser, select the ring text mark. A window is appeared. 
we have to input this uh, diameter of the range. This is we already measured this range diameter is uh, 18 millimeter. So we input this 18, one eight here. We use this uh, range rotary along the y, uh, x, x, x axis. Uh, so we put uh, this x and the uh, step per rotation is uh, just input to one two eight zero zero. Uh, and uh, other figures, just follow this figure is okay. It's uh, no need to change. And confirm here rain road. Rain diameter, uh, just follow this uh, parameter, is one eighth millimeter, and the rain height, this is the uh, width of this ring. We calculate this ring is a uh, four millimeter of the width. So we put four millimeter here. And this length is from the uh, bottom of this uh, rain rotary to this ring. Uh, this, uh, we uh, measure this, uh, this is 130 millimeter. And this angle um, will be input uh, 18, 18 degrees. You can uh, check this uh, uh, manual. Uh, just uh, follow this manual, you put these figures. And refresh in this uh, working area here. We will show the Working area, just like the rim marking working area. Then next, just like the last two checks position, right or not. Okay, when five words appeared on this cross ring. So the position is right now. Next. Reflect mark. Mark. Okay, work done. Okay, next we show you how to mark in on outside of the ring. First, uh, we change this uh, uh, spring from this unclockwise to clockwise. So this uh, rotary can hold this cross ring from inside like this. Make this ring is uh, properly installed on rotary. Uh, also, you have to adjust this uh, bolt here. Uh, make this uh, ring rotary on all rotating level. Zero degrees with the whole rotating level. OK, next, uh, we have to uh, adjust this focus also, because we already moved this uh, ring rotary from the high level uh, uh, downward, uh, lower to the whole rotating level. So, uh, make sure to adjust this focus list again. And next, uh, we collect this laser and select the rain pack mark. Mm, rain diameter, uh, we collect, we have to measure the uh, rain diameter like uh, 19.5. Because it's outside a ring, so it's different from inside. So I have to change this diameter to 19.5. Okay, and the ring height is the width of the, width of the ring is same or with the inside, so it's 4 centimeter. And the R130. And uh, for this uh, angle, we input this 0 degrees because now it's 0 degrees with the horizon level and a refresh. It's a new working area on this uh, working space. And uh, we check again its parameter. 
we are, we have to select the invert um, here. It's different from the marking inside, and the parameter is one nine decimal five millimeter. Other other parameter is the same with before to confirm. And uh, we select the red light. See if marking position is it right or not. Now it's okay. Next, we click mark. So the marking. Marking in progress. Okay, job's done. 